Hello guys, so today I finally was able to um, get the ship that I wanted to fly for a long time. I know I flew it, flew it uh, briefly during expos and that kind of stuff, but I was finally able to um, get an Anvil Gladiator to call my own. And um, I kind of have an affinity for ships that fire either big torpedoes or bigger missiles. And the Gladiator features, um, obviously, regular class, um, I believe I see a three or two missiles. Three, uh, six of each, uh, four of each, I believe. And um, it also has four size five missiles, in addition to two fixed hard points and then a turret, which is unfortunately controlled by another player so it is not slaved to you um that kind of sucks but if you have another player which uh that ship this ship really becomes pretty powerful um for what i would qualify a bomber it's actually really maneuverable it reminds me of uh um super hornet or hornet variants it's uh not as slow as you would expect so um, I figure out we'll take it out. We'll try to do a VHRT bounty with this and see how effective the size five missiles are. I don't have a lot of experience with this, but uh, well, let's find out. All right, so let's let's get it. It's kind of like that. It's um, let's see, drops down here and just come up. It's kind of cool. And it really has a really nice MFD layout. Lots of info, lots of screens. So let's request our clearance and go take this puppy out. And what do we got? We got four size two, four size fives, and then four size um, twos. For one cross cross section, once for thermal. Okay. All right. Not a not a bad layout, really. Not a bad armament either. The only bad thing is that the pilot controlled weapons are fixed. Um, might change that, but we'll see how it goes. Really need to get another buddy fly with me here to um, through the turret. All right. Let's check it out. And you can see when I open it, see the four size fives? That's pretty cool, isn't it? Pretty neat. And it's pretty quick, too. Let's see. Let's get out of the Atmo here. I mean, it, get, it gets up to speed. Oh, there's another pl uh, ship landing there. Maneuvering thrusters are definitely pretty aggressive. I know it's not meta. I know it's really not the ship, but I always liked the Gladiator. I always wanted one. So, uh, let's see if uh, meeting your heroes will uh, pay off or not. Nah, let's, I just wanna... I just wanna fire the size fives, to be honest with you. At least it's nice and close. Let's see how these size five, uh, size five missiles, because technically they're not torpedoes. These are five, size five missiles, will work out. And this, will, it will just be at night. 
Ah, come on. Yep, this will be at night, because why not? I guess dusk. Alright, let's see uh, how these size 5 missiles will perform here. I always thought it looked cool. I don't know. I always like the... Always like the... Um, Gladiator. Never had an opportunity to... Um, get one, but I really like it. Let's see what we got. Alright, where's my target here? And what is this? Hurricane? Okay. Why am I having a hard time? Oh, is that gonna miss? Target yep. Destroyed. I guess that wasn't my bounty, huh? Missile gonna do anything? What's going on here? I'm having a hard time hitting it. Let's go in a little closer. That's weird. I'm having a hell of a time logging into uh, locking into it. For good measure, we're we gonna go. If we're gonna go rearm, we might as well kill one of these. I love missiles, I don't know why. <laughs> Let's see. <laughs> I don't know why this is so much fun, but it is. You get... You get a car, and you get a car. <laughs> oh... Uh, they despawn. Yeah, they despawned. Okay. Let's go rearm here. It's actually pretty fun. Where can we go? I want to see what the rearm costs are. Oops, wrong button. Mm. Why don't we just go to... Uh, there you go. That won't let me navigate to this... Ah, we'll, we'll go here, then we'll find, then we'll go to the space station. That didn't weird. Um, I'll tell you what, though, I, I like this more, more than I thought I would. Okay, so that was 
that gave us with the three ships that gave us 17500 with three ships because of the call to arms so we made let's say 19000 19000 credits right okay let's end, let's end this calm Okay, let's see here. Are you gonna let me travel to the station now? Be around here or somewhere, maybe not. Okay, let's see if I can navigate to it. Please fix. I don't think it let me. Nope. Okay. Let's try this again. I don't know why it won't let me do it. Come on. Please. There we go. Must have been off a little bit. Ew. Um, but so far, I mean, how maneuverable it is. I really enjoy it. Let's see. Let's see what it will cost to rearm this after firing all these missiles here. Ah, looks cool. Hey, how about we slow down so we don't, you know, run into the damn thing. What's the... It was kind of weird how um, I was having trouble locking on. That was unusual. Yes, yes. Please proceed to assign landing bay. Okay. Let's go do it. You know, the fastest way to be is just to have all your ships at the space station. You don't have to waste time getting on the tram and, you know, it's a lot, it's a lot quicker when, uh, you know, you're playing uh, li on live servers to just, just to have all your ships on the space station. A lot quicker to get in and out. Okay, let's see what it will cost us. Oh, and apparently the bug is alive and well, where it will not let me restock. Are you gonna do it now? And nope, no service requires. Awesome. What if I go to... Let's see if we go to Area 18. If it will um, let us do it. Because clearly we can't restock here, which is quite annoying. All right. You are clear to launch. Still, still won't let me. Oh, okay. Whoops. Underestimated my turn radius there.
But I love how maneuverable this thing is. You're welcome. Now, where where I need to go? Where's the stuff? There it is. No, oh, what are you doing? Woo! You guys see that? I thought I was done. That was crazy. Definitely a first one for me. Alright, let's see if we can rearm here a little bit. The one thing I do love about it is that it doesn't feel sluggish. I mean, it actually feels fun to fly. I mean, look how quick we're actually getting from place to place. Now, once it's on full speed, it is not that maneuverable. When you reduce it, it, it becomes all right. Slow CM speed, but that's okay. That's what the turret gunner would be for, ideally. Let's see. Yes, yes, yes. Okay. Let's see if you're gonna let me rearm, buddy. Please proceed to side landing bay. Same. Okay, let's see if it let us rearm. Oh, it does. Okay, so full restock, and we fired a total of six size 2 missiles and four size 5 missiles. Restock is 2,700 credits, and we just made... 19,000. Actually, might have been 19,500. That's not bad. And honestly, we could have just gotten away with using one or two missiles only. But, so, to cut to cut time on your rearm between missions. But honestly, if you can just chain HRT or VHRT bounties um, with a ship that's quicker, that's not a bad way to make money, honestly. Sit, in, sit around, sling some missiles, you know, chill out, and it's not a bad way to, um, to make credits. Um, it looks like size 5 missiles is fairly, it's fairly effective. I mean, we got our missiles back and everything. That's not a bad, that's not a bad restock price. Um, we'll definitely do more videos with Gladiator. I'll probably just do one video where we just grind a bunch of bounties and see if we can um, run away to um, even higher bounty. Might as well, since the patch is still here and it didn't reset the rep. And we'll use a Gladiator more. I just didn't want to make this video too long. Alright guys, um, so far I really like the Gladiator. Do you guys have one? What do you guys think of one? Let me know. And I will see you in the next one. Take care.